Hey guys, Trey here from Getting Grub. Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to take a break from the kitchen to talk about commercials. Not that I want to sell you on anything, I just think they're hilarious. That's why this week we're cooking up some comedy with some of my favorite food commercials. Before we get started, if you enjoy the videos, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell to know when the latest videos come out. Back to the topic at hand, commercials. First up, Lint Chocolate. We all love chocolate. Oh, hot fudge Sunday. Extra hot fudge. We can't get enough of it. Augusto Sweetheart saves some room for later. We would be made of chocolate if we could. Sam, I can't breathe. It's sensual. It's melting point is at the same heat as body temperature. Do you dream in chocolate? Taste the Lindor truffle created with passion only by Lind's master chocolatiers. I don't know a lot about chocolate. What I do know is Lint Chocolate got some of the sexiest chocolatiers I've ever seen. Like nothing you've ever experienced. I haven't met many chocolatiers, so I can't really tell you if they're all not sexy, but it just kind of feels like a fat career path to me. Clydesdale. As a child, chocolatiers seemed like a definite career path. Kind of chubby, really like chocolate. Augustus Gloop was my homie. R.I.P. You magnificent fatso. He's blocking all the chocolate. But I couldn't help but notice the sexy Swiss chocolatier in this commercial. He's a beautiful man. Perfect, pepper gray, feathered back hair, strong, hard jawline, real GQ. I mean, either he's a supervillain or he's a gigolo. No in between. When Lindor's irresistible center starts to melt, so will you. Smooth, flowing, luscious. Chocolate like no other. The Lindor Truffle from the Lint Master Chocolatier. And how horny are women for chocolate? Stroking the chocolate. Squirming while opening the chocolate. Mm -mm. We all love chocolate. Calm down, Lent. Jesus. Sexual. This next commercial, we go from cocoa bean to coffee bean. In probably the most ridiculous commercial I've ever seen. Folgers made a commercial so hilariously cringeworthy it haunts my dreams at night let's just dive in we'll see you'll see your husband woke up first okay so they open with the usual coffee commercial you know get out of bed in the robe it's the morning routine let's go get some coffee okay hold on they said the husband woke up first Okay, we set in the scene. Your husband woke up first. Now you've got something up your sleeve. Oh, snap. Here come the robe. Ooh, look, look. She fine. Now you've got something up your sleeve. What you didn't know was... My God. Look at his face. Oh, instant shock. First of all, my hat goes off to this guy. <laughs> his acting. Uh, the look in his eye is equal of terror and enjoyment. You know? <laughs> you were surprising your father-in-law, Steve. Secondly, give it up to the wife for trying to get some morning D. In the shower, nonetheless. Take a minute to clear your head because that was really bad. This is not her husband. This is quote unquote her father in law, Steve. Clear my head? <laughs> you better Bailey's up this coffee. Gotta get the picture of your dad's balls out of my head. That was really bad. Oh no, 
Oh yeah. And the worst part is you just started calling him dad. Hold on. Hold on, Steve. What? What is this with this? All this soap? Ain't nobody taught you how to wash? There's two scenarios here. Either you felt so bad, you rushed out to apologize. In that case, don't drink a cup of coffee dripping with soap in just a towel with your man boobs out. Or you thought you was done and figured, I'll go grab me a cup of coffee with soap all over your tig old man bitties. I'm not sure where he gets all his body confidence from, but if he got a little extra, I'd take some. Just saying. The best part of waking up is folders in your cup. That video is ridiculous. But finally, let's end on a high note. An oldie but a goodie. The Pillsbury Dope Boy. <laughs> <laughs> He's been tickled his whole life. His whole fictional life. Sometimes it's just too far, bro. It's too far. Check it out. You'll have fun making these new cupcakes. They're microwave easy with funfetti frosting. Hold on. I don't like the sound that frosting made. I don't like it one bit. It's got a whole thing to it. And funfetti sprinkles. New Pillsbury Funfetti Microwave Cupcakes. Hey, cheer up. Yeah, the dope boy seems to be having a good time. He's giggling, laughing, having a good time. Cheer up. And... That's how croissants are made. You crossed the line, you took it too far. Can we talk about the animation here? I love animation. I talk about it all the time over on the Swervy Jones show. Link in the description. So this this is definitely claymation. So here, if we watch this in slow motion. Sorry, it's not as good quality as the old commercial. We're on <laughs> create a puddle. <laughs> and essentially, he poops out a croissant. <laughs> Fantastic! Oh. I know this video is a, a little bit different than what we've normally been doing. Let us know if you enjoyed it in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Got a clip you want us to talk about? Put it in the Get and Grub group on Facebook. Link is in the description. We'll be back with more delicious things in the next video. Thanks for watching.